everybody and welcome to this week's episode of Wildlife Wednesday where we're going to be talking about Ireland's biggest land mammal, the red deer, or Nathania Jarrod. So the red deer is a big character in Johnny McGorry in the Game of Rounders books and in particular he takes the form of Lord Stag. So as I tell you to the kids, a stag is basically a male deer. They're also known as a book. And in a female deer, as we all know the old song goes, do a deer, a female deer. <laughs> and then of course their kids are actually either called kids or fawns or calves. So as I said, the red deer is actually Ireland's biggest land mammal. And they can live for approximately in or around 12 to 15 years in the wild, but some have been known to live over 20 years. So the main characteristic of a deer and something that everybody knows is obviously their antlers. And the antlers will only grow on the male deers and they grow once a year and then they shed them every single year. So basically when the males are small, they might grow and they might just have one or two twines, which is the prong sticking off them. But as the male gets older, they can have up to 12 twines, basically, tines, sorry, on their antlers. And this, I suppose, is it shows the other deers, you know, that this guy is like really high up the ranks in terms of the socialness within the group and also then how old they are as well. So when the antlers are growing, they have this kind of soft skin like fur on them when they're starting to grow. But the male basically uses antlers off the side of trees or maybe even when he's fighting or that and they harden them up. And that's when they become the hard antlers that we know. So if you get lucky, you might be able to find a set of antlers that have fallen off the deer because they lose them every year. So we're talking about the red deer today, and this is actually the only indigenous species of deer within Ireland. So there is a few different species, but the red deer has been around since after the Ice Age, or since before the Ice Age, I should say. And the last actual pack or herd of red deer in Ireland, the last intact one that hasn't bred with other species, is down in Killarney National Park in County Kerry. So you definitely have to take a spin down to Kerry, down to Killarney, maybe see a book cross house, but also go and see the actual last remaining herd of red deer within Ireland. So you'll find deer, they usually live within maybe woods, but also where there's flat grazing ground. So there is some across the Midlands, across the bogs of Ireland, and then there's also some around up in the mountains and everything. But basically what they eat then is they'll eat grass and they'll also eat maybe some herbs, some vegetation, but also the sap out of trees. And they're known, especially around oak trees and holly trees, to go up maybe about this height and to basically they'll strip off the bark with their teeth and they get all the brilliant nutrients out from the tree to keep them going over the winter. So that's it for today's episode. As always, if you have any queries, comments, whatever, just leave them down below and I'll definitely get back to you. Hopefully you can share this with a little explorer and encourage them to maybe get outside and learn all about our beautiful Irish wildlife and of course our Irish heritage. Take care.